Get the real news at realrawnews.com. Article entitled, Gitmo Fins Off Deep State Drone Attack. Article dated December 5, 2023. U.S. Navy forces at Guantanamo Bay shot down a pair of MQ-9 Reaper unmanned aerial vehicles that penetrated the base's air defense identification zone on Saturday night, JAG sources told Real Raw News. At approximately 9.30 p.m., radar operators at Leeward Point Airfield detected two bogies heading northwest over the sea towards Gitmo. At the same time, a radar technician aboard one of the two Arleigh Burke-class destroyers protecting the base confirmed the track and suspected the bogies were high-altitude attack and surveillance drones, flying at 42,000 feet at 300 miles per hour too slow for a commercial airliner and too high for a regional general aviation aircraft. They did not respond to Mode C transponder interrogation or answer radio calls. All signs pointed to a drone incursion and we weren't taking any chances, our source said. We know what damage they can cause and what they caused at MCLB Albany. The radar men highly suspected they were Reapers or similar. The General Atomics MQ-9 Reaper is a remotely piloted UAV developed primarily for the U.S. Air Force. Its 66-foot wingspan and 240 horsepower turboprop engines allow flight speeds of 240 knots at up to 50,000 feet. Its armament can include AGM-114 Hellfire missiles with an unclassified range of 11 kilometers, depending on launch altitude or Paveway laser-guided bombs. The Reaper's operational range is said to be about 1,150 nautical miles. As the rapidly descending bogies approached within 35 miles of Gitmo, the Arleigh Burke class destroyer launched two RIM-66 surface-to-air missiles at the approaching targets. The missile struck and obliterated the UAVs. Meanwhile, Gitmo leadership debated whether the drones were a diversion, but no other signs of an imminent attack appeared. Tensions are high. It's been almost a year since the Christmas Day assault, and we can't leave anything to chance, our source said. A helicopter, he added, was immediately sent to the interception point where the crew saw surface debris consistent with Reaper UAVs. We're almost sure the deep state is a clandestine base in Haiti, and what I can say is, once we've confirmed the location, we'll be wiping it off the map. You can, you can take that to the bank. In fact, me, maybe we already have, the source said. Asked if Gitmo leadership speculated why the deep state sent quickly destroyable drones instead of a flotilla, the source said, look, it can be anything from probing our defenses to wanting to take out one of their own. You know, who they think might spill some beans, so to speak. If they got close enough, the drones could have popped off four Hellfire missiles at Camp Delta and taken out a bunch of deep state detainees. Guantanamo Bay, he said, is closing, and we'll, but we'll maintain... I'm sorry, Guantanamo Bay, he said, in closing, will maintain a heightened state of vigilance in the aftermath of the drone shootdown. 